Hey everyone, welcome to Never Metal Guns and Outdoors. Thought I'd give you a little tour of the gun store today. Maybe an item or two you might like to see. Let's check it out. Alright, as you walk in, you notice that we have some ammo for sale. Uh, mostly range stuff, but there is some personal defense rounds over there. You'll come over here to the wall. There's your AK and 22, your AR. And I'll do a video on this later. There's an AR-15 mag loader. And that one was specially custom made for me. Thanks to my buddy Tim for that. We've got a nice Ted Williams. There's your Remington if you want to go hunting. We've got some mill serfs here. There's an 08mm, an Ishapur. And then we've got three of the Mosins. Love them Mosins. And gotta have some 22s. You basic Glenfield, Marlin slash 60, uh, Remington of Savage, and then that pretty Henry on top. And back here, no tried but true. Just your basic single shot shotguns. You can't beat them. Now that one on top is an old bolt action 12. That's from uh, uh, early 1950s. Then we do have some uh, compound bows in stock. They're the older models, but you can get an excellent deal on them. For those of y'all that are really into bows, there's a crossbow. Now that thing really sling an arrow. And we do carry some black powder rifles as well. And some airsoft and some BB guns. Then some accessories. There's a vest. There's a police belt, some shoulder holsters, cases, miscellaneous holsters, and items like that. Then we'll come on around to the cases. Now this is the part I like. I'm a big pistol guy. Just going to roll down through here and let y'all see what's going on. Ruger, Remington, Diamondback, Smith & Wesson. Remington, there's that double tap Terringer in 9mm, you need that. Here we got the Ruger, a couple of Skies, Taurus Spectrum, check this one out. I got the white one this time, it looks pretty awesome, don't it? And there's a Smith, that's a Shield EZ380, awesome, awesome little pistol. And of course, always rocking a Beretta here and there. And we still have the Phoenix Arms on sale. These are outstanding little 22s. And by the way, y'all can catch videos from pretty much all the guns in here if you want to see how they run and all the particulars of them. And we've got our Keystone Crickets. One of them is 22 long rifle. Another one shoots a 22 mag. And then we've got a few revolvers back here. A couple of the Heritage Rough Riders. This one's got the basic wood style grips on it. Or this has got the marble looking grips, which I think looks really nice. Nice Rexio 22. Now that's a 9 shot. And there's our Charter Arms 44 Special Bulldog. That thing's cool. And this one won't be here much longer. 1911 Smith & Wesson VA-45. That thing is just too sweet. And down here we do have some holsters. Down in the bottom of this cabinet and a couple of accessories. Now back here I've got me some high points. Now I don't want to hear no bad mouthing. These things run and they run well. Yeah, they're heavy and they're big, but... Hey, it functions. For the money, they're really hard to beat. Down here, got a little black powder going on. There's a 44 black powder. There's an old 1756 Navy. Now that is reproduction. Uh, I'm not sure what caliber that one is. Let's just call it huge. Now over here, we have our parts of repair firearms. 
Some of you people like to buy them dirt cheap and fix them up. Well, hey, that's cool with me. Now, here's some antiques. It's an old U.S. Revolver Company 38. And then here's a couple of old 25s. Don't see them much around anymore. Then we've got a couple of scopes in here. Got one of our cannons. We custom make them cannons in the house. And night vision still sitting here. Somebody needs to cut me a deal on that. And there's some uh, stuff for the uh, airsoft and the BB guns. You see we've got tons of little airsoft stuff down there. Then here's our other last cabinet. Uh, got our tasers. And oh yeah. Little knives right here. Pretty cool. Little credit card knives. And then just some basic pocket knives. Nothing real expensive. Something that you can afford. Throw it in your pocket. Throw it in your old truck or tractor or what have you. And if you did happen to break it, well you ain't lost a ton of money. Well there we have it. Hope y'all like my little gun store. I'm sure you've seen something that you would like. And remember, we can ship anything to your FFL. No problem. We will take care of you and treat you right. Appreciate you watching the video. If you would, throw me down some comments and questions and suggestions. Always appreciate it. And if you're able, hit us up on Patreon. And hit that like and subscribe button. And before I go, Got a couple of people I want to throw a shout out to. Kenneth, thanks for the call the other day. It was real nice talking to you. Several other people have called me also. Kaboom has called. And my buddy Tim called. And there were some others that have stopped by from out of state just to say hi and meet me. And everyone's just been super nice and everything. And like I say, my buddy Tim, he has done some donations to the channel for some ammo. Uh, he's the one that made me the uh, AR-15 loader up there, so an extra special thanks to him. And thanks to all of y'all for sticking with me and watching the channel and supporting me like you do. Everybody, thanks a lot, and I hope you have a fantastic day.